James. Thank you for clicking on this video. Today we're going to be explaining Bonnie's double fruit. Toshi, Toshi no me. Older has been telling us for the longest. Toshi, Toshi, or age age fruit is basically the double fruit Bonnie has, which allows her to change her age and also change other people's age. But he lied. He's a liar. And we love Oda for that. In chapter 1001, Bonnie was seen changing her arm into Luffy's gear third to hit Connie in the face. That is an additional ability. It allows her to distort the future and transform her body into any shape that she envisions from the future, any double fruit that she envisions from the future. So she went, technically she went gear third before Luffy did. She didn't know what it was, she just seen it from her distorted future, which is, which does her double fruit, which is OP. So she can distort her future into Luffy not being a Sangai Nika and her being a Sangai Nika. That's her additional ability of that double fruit. Now Oda has not explained this at all. He just given us little 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 pieces of evidence for us to pick up on. Now in chapter 1044, they just told that devil fruits have a will of its own. Devil fruit chooses its user. Hence why literally smoker has a devil fruit that allows them to smoke. People have devil fruits that matches up with their lifestyle and what they want to do. Freaking Brooke, his ability allows him to not die. He was made to get that devil fruit so he can meet up with the straw hats and have become one of the straw hats. Like, cause he was, he's old as hell. Like he was meant to have that devil fruit because it was destined for him to meet up with the straw hats and become one of the straw hats. Ani, gain that devil fruit because she was damn near meant to eat that motherfucker okay what's the extent of bonnie's power she literally can become Kaido's dragon distort her future to become him distort her future to become joy boy for real like luffy has a kid like mind a kid like imagination which allows him to become joy boy and spread joy and laughter to anything that he touches Ani is a kid, she's like 12, so she has that same ability, which it can low-key help Luffy come Joy Boy, it, the, probably the progenitor of the Sun God Nika Devil Fruit, it's like, it's, it's just a kid imagination. Bonnie has that same imagination where she could become Joy Boy. Really, her power really might be one of the most powerful Devil Fruits in One Piece, because I mean, she could become any devil fruit just by distorting her future. Essentially what it does is it makes it to where that person doesn't exist anymore and she becomes the user of that devil fruit and, and is allowed to use that devil fruit. I think that's her awakening ability, I'm not sure. I don't think it's even her awakening ability. Maybe her awakening ability is becoming Sun God Nika because Kuma's been telling her about Sun God Nika ever since she was a child and she wants to meet him so bad that she just might become him just from a kid-like imagination manifesting in her mind to become Sun God Nika. That's all I got for y'all today, man. I just wanted to go ahead and get this out there because, I mean, One Piece is going crazy right now. Egghead might, just might, could be the best arc in One Piece right now. Better than Marine Ford. We're getting everything is coming out in the open. What the D is, no pause, all Diddy. What the, what freaking Kuma, how he, became what he became why he became what he became we're seeing the elders pop out with the smokies i'm talking about saturn being summoned like a demon oni everything is coming out but i love you guys thank you for clicking on this video hopefully you learned something see you on the next one on girl tv we out